I hope you're all well. Welcome back to my YouTube channel um, and another haul. There have been so many hauls, guys, I'm so sorry, but I just want to show you what's new in my wardrobe and I've been ordering a lot, I have been sitting and sent a lot, um, so yeah, there's a lot. <laughs> Most of this stuff is stuff I've been sent, though some of it I have purchased myself, so I'll just talk you through it um, as I go through, but I try not to mention it too much just because uh, I want to be open and honest with you guys, but I did mention it in all my videos when the new rules first came in, and I got told that I was being showy offy, so it's kind of hard to know what is right but yeah anyway so the first thing that i want to show you is a skirt that i got gifted from marge um and i love this now jack was like the first word that springs to mind when i see that skirt is ethel and i was like ethel what like basically old ladies but i love it i think it's so cool i love it it's like ribbed um and then it's got this really nice cream tipping detail i actually shot this instagram ages ago already but i need to i haven't got around to posting it yet because i like get really into the mood and take loads of pictures and then i'm like i've got literally a month's worth of pictures <laughs> um but yeah so i haven't got around to posting this yet but i love it and i love the little pockets i just think it's so cute and it's it's really heavy actually it's a really good quality skirt um it's a lot tighter on than i expected it maybe i need you to get the next size up but with um marge gifting there's not oft options of different sizes like basically they give you a link to the website i don't know if you guys find this interesting or not let me know if you do and i'll keep sharing this information but they give you like a link to the website um, and there's like one of each piece that they are offering to gift in a particular size um and once it's gone it's gone and it's not like there's there wasn't like five options for this skirt it's like this skirt is size 10 whatever it is and that is the one that you can pick um and so like it's kind of like a race to get there because like if you get there last then you get stuck with like something you probably don't want or you just don't get anything because you don't want it but i got this skirt and i love it so this is the skirt on and i've just worn it with my racer vest but i've just kind of scrunched my racer vest up to make it into a crop top and i quite like how it's all like scrunched up i think it looks cute and this skirt is just so nice it's so soft on the skin because it's knitted um, and it just fits really well. Do you see what I mean about it not being what it would look like it being on? Because you would expect from looking at it that it would be like that. Um, but it's not. Uh, but I, I really like it. I think it's so pretty. I just love the nude and the white together. It's just so gorgeous. And just I can't stop touching it. It's so soft. Um, and I love it with the trainers. But I'd also wear it with like little heels. It would look cute with a blazer too. So I think it's kind of like because it's knitted as well i think you could wear it all year round so i also got some bits from river island um if you don't follow me on instagram then you probably don't know but i'm actually a river island ambassador this year and i love river island like honestly i feel like i kind of wrote them off quite a lot in the past um i really like their stuff but sometimes i find it's quite girly and sometimes glitzy for me um but I found some really nice pieces since I've been working with them and even the PR like when I went and met her she was like oh my god where's your coat from and I was like it's River Island and she was like what um so I feel like there are some amazing pieces online and also I really discovered the River Island men's section like you guys are probably sick and tired of hearing me talk about shopping in the men's section but I just love their stuff so I've got quite a few bits to show you from them and particularly the men's section um so these are all gifts so these are, <laughs> I've worn them, but I only worn them for like a couple of hours, but like, yeah, they're a bit dirty, but I want to show you guys them, so <laughs> they are like the sports socks, so they're like the Nike socks, but I know they're sold out, and I also just really like, these socks are, I find them so comfortable, these sporty socks, I've like converted, like I've got some new Nike ones here too, like I'm just obsessed with them, um, so yeah, these are like really cosy for wearing around the house for loungewear, and also I just think they look cool in pictures with like trainers, and just in life, I would say in pictures because that's like how my life and my brain works. But I just mean in life. Um, but yeah, so I got these. Then from the women's section, I got this top. So it's just like a really simple t-shirt. I've got a little bit of a mark on it. Again, I've worn this. Um, with this puff shoulder detail. Now this is what I mean about glitzy. So it's got a little bit of glitz here around this uh circle but you can't actually see that um i mean you guys might like that feature but i um i wouldn't have picked something with glitz on but you can't even see the glitz like so it doesn't matter 
Um, but yeah, I really like it. It's such a nice kind of casual passive top. But I like the fact that it has got this tie detail because it just adds a bit, a little bit of something, something to it. Um, it's just like a t-shirt with a twist, to be honest. And you guys know how much I go on and on about how much I love, like, an everyday wardrobe staple with a little bit of something different to make it stand out. So this is a t-shirt tucked in to the shorts, which is how I got it to wear, so I wanted to show you like that. Um, and they're just so cute with these little puff sleeves with the bows on them. Um, obviously, I'll show you this untucked sheet, but I won't wear untucked with this outfit. Um, but it would look so nice with like jeans as well, or a smart pair of trousers. Just feel like, as I said, it is like a wardrobe staple with a twist. Then I got a set from the men's section. I didn't get it to wear as a set. I'm gonna put a picture in of how I shot it. Um, which is exactly how I had like pictured it. So I wanted to wear the shorts with the t-shirt and then I wanted the uh, hoodie because I thought the, the matching green would look really nice. Just a little bit of green to wear around my neck. Uh, and that's exactly how I wore it and it looked really good in my opinion. Um, and I also rolled these shorts up. So I'm loving sweat shorts at the moment. And I got these ones. I've actually got the jocking bottom version of these in grey. I'm wearing them right now and I love them. They are so cosy and fleecy um, and they do these in a really nice like pink colour. I think it's a bit lighter than this as well and hoodie. Um, but they've got pockets and they're a bit longer and they look really cool I thought. Just long as well but also like rolled up like this. Um, I just thought they were really cool and a bit different to like everything I've been seeing. And also like I really love the racer shorts and I've been wearing them myself. And I have worn them out but they are quite short so... Um, these are more kind of conservative sweatpants short type things um, so yeah I wanted to show you those and they are so comfortable so these are the shorts on and as you can see I just love them I've done them up um, tight so they're like super high waisted and I just think that they look so nice I love the colour um, and I think they look really cool with like this outfit but then also what I was trying to say before is I would wear them like this too like rolled up for like a cute um I don't know like a more kind of look uh although does that look make me look like I'm wearing a nappy but yeah I think they're so nice then um obviously I got the matching hoodie um and I've got this hoodie in grey too because I've got the grey joggers and I've got the whole set as like a sweatsuit type thing so it's like a short sweatsuit um, but yeah they've got the this in grey they've got it in pink um, and I just really loved this mint green I think it's so cute and I don't know if I'd wear it all together as like a sweatsuit I mean I would in the grey in the grey in trousers but I feel like a short sweatsuit for me is too far <laughs> but I would wear I think this would look really cute with like to get denim shorts cream jogger shorts with um like cream jeans like I just think it's a really nice sweatshirt and also for like adding a bit of colour to your outfit if you don't want to wear it you could do what I did in my picture and wear it around your shoulders just like adds a bit of colour. So I just want to show you the full outfit with the hoodie um, because this is how I pl planned to wear it and did wear it for my post just because I just really liked how it's, A it is actually extra warm having it like this and B it's just like adds a little bit of something to the outfit brings it all together but let me show you it um, on as an actual hoodie so this is it actually on as a hoodie and I've just tucked it under to show you like as a tracksuit it actually looks really cute I didn't think I would wear it like this but I'm kind of loving this little tracksuit it's so cute they've got it in lots of different colours too like baby pink and stuff um, but let me just show you it's full length because it's a really nice hoodie just to wear like with my cream shorts or with jeans or something um, so that's it as a hoodie it's actually quite tight on me around here so I probably would have sized up a bit um, but yeah it's really cosy and cute so the next thing was a complete surprise to me I just got sent this um, as a gift like they didn't even tell me they were sending me a gift um, but I'd worked with them before so they knew my address and it's this underwear set from the brand Le Girl Le Boy and you might remember I have featured them before on here because I got gifted another underwear set and a sweatsuit like hoodie and jogger set but I actually picked those things out whereas this was a complete surprise and do you know what I would never have picked this but I really like it so um, it's got this really small band around the waistline that has the logo on it, which is cool. Um, and then it's kind of like this, I don't know how I feel about, like, I don't know if I would take a picture of this to put on Instagram, purely because I don't know how, obviously I haven't tried it on yet, you can tell by the tags, I've been waiting to show you guys, but 
it's kind of like see-through <laughs> which is fine for underwear because I mean if so you someone is seeing you in your underwear then you probably want them to see what's underneath <laughs> but um yeah I don't know if I'd put it on Instagram but I don't know I, I'm gonna try it on and I'll show if if um it's not see-through then I will show you it in some way that I feel comfortable but this is a bra um and it's it's like a kind of in between a sports bra and a normal bra it's like a soft bra i love these bras they're so comfortable uh it does up at the back it's not like one you put over your head uh, and it's got this little kind of eyelet is it an eyelet detail there it's like a little cut out which is cute so just adds a little bit more detail to it it's got just adjust adjustable straps too like normal bra straps then something random that i want to show you that i got sent from someone this is like kind of a birthday present basically um a brand like a really small independent brand on instagram messaged me and said that they would like to send me some pieces um for a birthday gift or something for a birthday gift and they obviously i've been wearing these night socks loads and they said they would send me a pair that were tie-dyed i've already worn these for a picture but i took them straight off because i wanted to show you guys so they're not dirty um but how cute are these yellow is like my favorite color at the moment and i just love them they are so cute the tie dye is like perfect too like can you see it's just like so perfectly tie dyed and i'm so amazed that the, the tick hasn't like run or anything or like gone like they've just done it perfectly and they also sent me a pair for jack too but he said that i can have them because he will literally just wear them and like no one will see them and i feel like these socks need to be worn for people to see um and these are blue tie dye and i love them they're so cool maybe i should do like one with like one and one and one of the other the colors go so nice together so next i have some more formal things to show you from ted baker and i'm apologizing for my noisy dog in the background because she seems to be very vocal about something i don't know what's annoying her but she is literally just barking away and there's no one at the door or anything so who knows um but i got this dress from ted baker uh, and it's actually to promote their sale which should be live now and it's a really good sale so this dress is on sale so i did a paid collaboration with them so this is part of paid collaboration but this isn't sorry let me start again this dress was for a paid collaboration on instagram not on here i just wanted to show you guys because i love to show a good sale uh, and i actually posted a tiny bit of this dress on my stories because i was what was i doing oh I, I was using my sister's instagram filter so you could just see a bit of my neckline and then everyone was like where's that dress from and it's this one and it's on sale um so it's like a maxi dress and it's so beautiful this is like perfect for like a summer wedding um just like so many occasions this would be perfect for but i think you can dress it down too um so it's just got this really nice kind of like cut out detail at the back beautiful buttons just beautiful quality as is everything from ted baker uh, I've got a bit of neck makeup on the neckline as usual, but it's just such a lovely fit. And then, so this is the dress on, and just look at how beautiful this is. Um, and yes, it's definitely in the sale at the moment, and it's just the most beautiful print. Um, it's got this lovely kind of dobby material texture to it. I think it's so flattering how it goes in at the waist too and this neckline is also super 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 flattering and it just comes to a really nice point on me i'm five foot seven and a half or five foot eight and i just think it comes to such a nice point it's a really flattering style and even though it looks really nice with these i would dress it down with like espadrilles or with a flat sandal um i think it's something that you could wear for most occasions but how i've got it now it looks so nice and formal for a wedding or like the races or like any of those kind of occasions but i just think it's beautiful i also got a cardigan so i wanted to wear them together i haven't actually taken the label off the cardigan and um, so i just wore it as i said i'm i'm just loving the sporty 90s kind of trend at the moment and like the preppy look so most of my pictures i've got something around my neck so i got this to wear um just draped over my neck and it looked really nice and this is just a really nice cardigan to be honest it's so soft um it's just so soft like ridiculously soft so yeah i want to show you that too if you want need a cute cream cardigan this is also in the sale uh, it's just got like the little ted baker buttons that look like screws um and it's it is honestly really soft <laughs> i said that so many times i'm like the ad advert of a toilet roll 
soft, soft, soft. So this is a cardigan on and I've just popped it on with my marge skirt because I think it looks so cute um, with the buttons running all the way down and this just hangs so nicely. I got a couple of sizes up because I wanted it to be loose um, and it just hangs perfectly. I like how it's still quite tight on the sleeves but this section is really nice. I actually prefer cardigans like this worn as a top rather than open as a cardigan. Um, and then I've just got my little heeled sandals on. So it's a really cute like little kind of smart mix and match look. And I just think the white in the cardigan picks out the white in the skirt. And it's just so cute. And I actually really like this cardigan so much on its own. Even though I only got it to wear over the shoulders with the dress. I just think it looks so cute like this. Um, and it's so, I can't get over how soft it is guys. And then the final thing I want to show you is something that I treated myself to the other day. And it's another thing from Anon Bing. Now, this is the first Anon Bing sweatshirt I've ever got. Um, and basically, I ordered some stuff. So this is like kind of a horror story about Revolve, but not. I work with them, and I like their stuff. Uh, and I've, to be fair, their shipping is insane. Like, I ordered this, and three days later, it was there. But I ordered something from them before. And they, um, and another good thing, free shipping and no tax and duties, which is amazing. But anyway, I ordered something from them and it was before my honeymoon and I decided that I didn't want to keep it because it was so faithful. It was really expensive. It was really nice, but I just thought I probably won't wear it much after my honeymoon. So I just thought it's not worth spending like $200 on something. And then they refunded me to a gift card, even though I'd used money, my own bank card to buy it. So I was really annoyed about it, but I kept being like, oh, I'll oh, ring them tomorrow, I'll ring them tomorrow, I'll ring them tomorrow, literally then like six months passes <laughs> um so the other day i was going through my starred emails and then i found the email with the code on for the gift card and i was like oh for god's sake and then i thought do you know what jack was gonna buy me this for my birthday he told me so i was like do you know what? i'm gonna buy it i'm just gonna buy it for myself because i really like it and i like the fact that he thought that he was gonna get it for me um and i've always wanted an anan bing sweatshirt and it ended up costing me 18 dollars because i'd got my other voucher so because I'd forgotten about them and it kind of felt like free money. So, I got this sweatshirt. Now you know my life story. <laughs> um, and it's so nice. It's such a nice, like, white sweatshirt. I got it in a... Um, does it say what size I got it in? A, I got it in a medium. Um, which I think is what my t-shirts are. And I just really like the logo. I like the fact that it's white. Because I think I'll wear it with everything. Even though I'll constantly be washing it because of the makeup. And um, the only thing that Jack mentioned, which I didn't really think about, but now that he said it, I do think about, is that it's, like, printed on it. Um, it's, like, not embroidered. And I kind of expected it to be embroidered for the price of the sweatshirt. Um, but it's just something to think about. But I really like the brand, and I love the sweatshirt, so it doesn't really bother me. Hopefully it won't come off in the wash. Um, I don't think it will. It's good quality. It looks pretty well, well done. Um, but, yeah. So this is my final thing and my most favourite thing because it's something I've wanted for ages and yeah, finally treated myself. Then this is my star purchase, my Anaheim Bing sweatshirt. It fits so nicely. It's actually more cropped than I expected. So I do like my sweatshirts to be quite oversized in like the length. I got a medium in this but I quite like the crop and I think it will look really nice with like high waisted, like these jeans it looks nice with and then like high waisted shorts and things. Um, so I'm not mad about it. I just, I, it's just a perfect white sweatshirt. <gasps> I'm going to get this so dirty, guys. I already know. But yeah, I just love it. And I've just got it on with my jeans and my trainers. I just think it's such a perfect casual everyday look. And I just love this sweatshirt so much. But thank you. I think that's everything. Yeah. So thank you so much for watching my video. I hope that you liked it. Well done if you got to the end because I've been blabbering for a while now. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what your favourites are. Are there any of these brands that you love, that you hate, that you haven't bought from before? Um, and I would love to hear your opinions. What do you think about the ways I styled them up? Uh, and are there any videos that you want to see from me? Maybe do you want me to style up that and I'm being sweatshirt because it's expensive. Um, or like one of their slogan tees. Um, I definitely want to do a video of cycling shorts. It might even be up by now. But someone's requested it and I really want to do that. But I just keep, um, I've just got so many hauls to do that I thought I need to just film them all and post them all because otherwise like the stuff will have sold out by the time. So that's why it might seem that I'm doing a lot of hauls all at once because I have a lot of stuff. And if I spread them out too far, then by the time I post it, 
it will be not in stock anymore so i hope that you understand that that's why it's a bit haul heavy at the moment but and because i clearly have shopping problems <laughs> but thank you so much for watching i hope that you enjoy this video uh don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already give this video a thumbs up it really helps my like algorithm on youtube when you give it a thumbs up so please do um and i will see you next time bye